Speed round. <laughs> hey everybody, welcome back. Hey everybody, welcome back. This is my video. Three, two, one, go. We're starting a QA. and a Last video that Silas and I did together was a, what was it? What do you think about Germany? Oh yeah, we did like, what do Americans think about Germany? We gave our opinions on our couple months that we've lived here and told you about our experience. Now, we're going into the comments of that video where we told you to ask questions and we're gonna read from the top to the bottom and we're gonna respond directly to your questions. And if you don't know who we are, my name is Carter Sullivan. This is Silas Nesita. Check out his channel in the description. Also, if you haven't seen our videos, see if you like them and if you do, please subscribe. Question number one, here we go. From Raf Maxi. I love Raf Maxi. What do you guys think about German politics and how long will you stay in Germany? Oh, so German politics, I'll take this question. Because this is my answer to every political question I receive. I don't get into politics. I stay out of politics because I'm not a politician at this point. What I do is I play football, I make videos, and I do my best in those areas to impact the world and you know do the best that I can there. And maybe later when I run for president, I'll start thinking about politics. What about you? Do you know anything about German politics? I honestly, I just don't know that much about German politics. Yeah. So second thing, how long will you stay in Germany? That's unknown. I have a one-year contract here to play football. The season will end in October. Before that time, maybe sometime in the summer, I'll figure out if I'm going to stay. How about you? Same. Um, don't know if I'll be back next year. Uh, it always depends on whether or not the team wants you back. Yeah. So if I have an opportunity, I might come back. Might I might not. be in China we'll or Japan. Next question. Or Thailand. Royal Potato. Do you like cities with skyscrapers in the US, like LA or New York? Or it says more than cities in Germany with small, older buildings? Ah, uh, that's a good question. Is it? Go ahead. The US has more cities with skyscrapers and skylines, but um, to me, skylines are really cool to just look at, but it's not that cool to like live in there. I don't like congestion. I like open space. Uh, I'm from Texas. Live in Texas. Texas. I like how there's tons of open space. Dallas has a nice little skyline. Houston has a nice little skyline. But um, skylines are cool to look at. I don't like to live in them. I like skylines to visit. So living though, I, I do like the spread out old buildings. Next question from Yeti. Yeti, my OG. I remember you. Yeti's been here since like 5,000 subscribers. What is something you guys miss back home besides family and friends? Ooh, that's a good question because I would have said family and friends are the most important thing. Taco Bell. In and out for me, man. I'm from California. I'm from California. I do miss you. I miss beaches. Sunsets at the Definitely. beach. The convenience of fast food is, is nice. And it's not just like greasy, gross fast food, but there's like a lot of places where you can go get quick food that's actually good food too. So it's true. I guess I missed that, but at the same time, like I, I, I really enjoyed grocery shopping. I, I grocery yeah. shop and cook a lot more here. I got a lot better at grocery shopping and cooking. You wanna go? I love living in a new country. I'm super happy here. I'm not eager to go back anytime soon because I love traveling, and I've lived in the U.S. my entire life. This is my first experience outside. For Matt Ryan, what is your favorite and least favorite German food? Boy, if you don't- Spetzle and pretzels mixed together into a smoothie. Bro. That's so hard. Uh, that is hard because we haven't been here no long enough to try yeah, everything. Honestly, I haven't eaten that much authentic German food, but what yeah. I have eaten, I really like, um, Edbeerplunder. That's the little pastry. That pastry, the strawberry. Oh, I get that once a week. My least favorite? Least favorite. Sorry, have you seen a movie in German language yet? Haven't. Here's a good one. How would you compare the general mentality? Would you say Germans are more strict than Americans? This is from R4INB0WD4SH. General mentality. Are Germans more strict than Americans? Yes. I would say yes. They come off as more strict on the little things here. But then there's also other things like the radio and the TV uncensored. You can say any word you want. That's less strict. But I think Germans in general are more more rule following than the U.S. It's such a melting pot. There's so many different people. I feel like people just do what they want, and the other people don't worry as much. Germans seem to worry or look after other, other people, people yeah. and what they're doing more. In the states, less people in the community will tell you you're doing something wrong. Exactly. In Germany, I think there's a good chance that people tell you you're doing something wrong, like wearing glasses inside. Like boy. Do you want to learn German in the next month? Absolutely. How does it make you feel that a lot of people in Germany speak English? How much easier does it make your time over here? If you go to Asia, there's not a lot of English speakers on the streets. You know, you have to really try to find it. 
in Europe and Germany specifically, a lot of people speak English and they're very good at it because they have to learn it mm -hmm. in primary school for 10 years and yeah. they're pretty good. I like it because I can communicate it. Yeah. I don't like it because it's hard for me to learn German if I don't have to speak it. Yeah, it definitely makes it harder to learn, but it is very nice because the transition is a lot easier. I go to the store, ask directions, it's a lot easier. This one's from Micah Ruiz. Let's go, Micah. Are we going to see Connor handing the ball off to Silas in the future? Oh! Do you guys ever think about being on the same team? Woo! Oh, we've thought about it. Trust me. But guess what? We met each other a month ago. Yeah. We met each other a month ago and we played each other in the very first game of the season. Nice. So now we're good friends. We love the same things in life and... Coming to a stadium near you. What's the deal with Americans and their sunglasses? Uh. For me, it's really just because I don't like looking at the side camera. That's a film tip. We're, we're filming on a camera right now that has a flip screen so we can see ourselves on the right side but what we have to look at is right in the middle. Yeah. So if I'm constantly looking over here. So it would be like as if I was like this. Yeah. The whole time. Imagine if I talked to you like this the whole time. Like, oh, guess what, guys? Welcome to. See, this is a lot better. Welcome hey, to. Boy, boy, boy. <laughs> Sunglasses also, uh, it's a little mysterious, you know, like James Bond. You yeah. feel private. So, like. If you know it's a public video, you feel a little private. Yeah, like when you're walking around, you a lot of times you just look dumb. So when you have glasses, people can't see your eyes. It's like they can't see you. It's like this weird phenomenon. If you have glasses on, and people are looking at you, they, it's like you, they don't see you when they can't see your eyes because your eyes have so much to do with you. But I don't think it's an American thing. There's a lot of Germans that wear sunglasses yeah, too. Yeah. It's also an eye protective thing. You know, I have light eyes and light skin, so my eyes get burned sometimes. So I have to wear glasses. It's true though. Is it? Yeah. Alright, speed round. This is getting long. Alright, speed round. Sal is going to go five in a row and I'm going to answer. Would you like to stay more than one year in Germany? Yes. Are you planning on playing next year because next year I want to come visit up there? Yes. What would you say is the best sight to see in Southwest Germany? Ooh. Leinfelden. <laughs> my house. That's my house. How does the GFL compare to college football in terms of skill level? Skill level, obviously, in college football, it's a lot higher because people there have been playing since they were kids. It's not a big thing in Germany, so. Yeah, so it's still getting there. In the U.S., it's a huge deal. So the skill level from a young age is higher. Let's go! Speed round. Will you go to Hanover 96 or VFB Stuttgart games now that they are in the Bundesliga top flight? Of course. I'm a, I'm a Bundesliga fiend. Look at this. I have a Vow FB hat. I'm going to go to every game next semester. Year. All right, we're wrapping up this video. If you haven't seen Silas's video of today, check out his channel and Watch subscribe. It. More questions in that video. Better questions. And they're going to come up. Same questions. <laughs> they're going to come up. We're going to have a couple more videos coming soon. So thank you for watching. Leave your suggestions below on what we should film. Because we do read your comments and we thank you for them. Sorry that I messed those words up. Do you want to do it again? No. Thanks for watching, y'all. Yes! Yeah.